dun 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 it's branded time it's extreme brandonism hey talk about the new movie you saw avatar huh oh you're done with the uh, yeah with the whole stupid or... thing yeah yeah good all right yeah avatar you know um dance with the smurfs uh furries in space whatever you want to call it it's actually pretty good you know um you know, the um, 3D is pretty, pretty good. Unlike, you know, past 3D movies I've seen where it gives you a headache five minutes in, it actually um, works fairly well. And okay. There was some blurriness, like, with some of the movements when they went too fast, but other than that, well, it worked well. Now, how did you like wearing glasses over glasses? Was that annoying, or did they actually work? And how well, was the glasses? Well, the glasses at my theater, Galaxy 12 in Riverbank, um, you know, the type of glasses they had were big enough, so they just kind of went over mine. Oh, so they're the ones that went over your glasses. Those were always nice, right? Yeah. So it was not an issue. Did you steal them or did you uh, recycle them? I recycled them. I've you can actually take them if you want to. That's why they charge you an extra three dollars for it. So I have no use to uh, overly large pair of novelty 3D glasses. Okay. Oh, what about just the memory of Avatar? Huh? The memory of the movie. You know, just kind of like a memorabilia. Um, I could just buy a little toy of Avatar if I wanted that or something. Okay, fair enough. And uh, what else did you? Uh, what else can you say about the movie? Um, oh, oh, that's pretty good. The action scenes are pretty good. Um, it's, it gets a little ambivalent with the whole humans are bastards angle. It always oh, does. Oh, too preachy then. You know, you know, they're not even. You know, like normally when they have a movie like this, humans go to some alien planet for some rare mineral. It's something they need to save the Earth. No, it's just because it's really valuable. You know, it's the okay. Of, it's not very honorable then. You know, oh. the whole thing like that. Um, not to mention the fact that I don't think the um, Navi, the you know blue alien cat people elves, on that have hardly any character flaws whatsoever. Especially oh, so they're basically just the perfect innocent you know savage and something. Oh, like pretty that. much, you know, they hate the whole noble savage thing up to eleven. Which <laughs> so you know so once you get past that, it's pretty good. Okay, so yeah. what about the special effects? It's all what CGI, right? Pretty much. All the people. Uh, I think the humans are normal. Oh, the humans are normal, just everything else is yeah, then? Pretty much. Okay, interesting. So how'd you like that? Was that just too much for you, or did it no, flow it's... very well? It worked well. Now, you and uh, Russell was talking about how it was part of the Alien universe. No, it was made by the same creator, but some of the things look similar, like, um, what's her face? Uh, Should we go over Weaver? Yeah. You know, she's in it. So a lot of her scenes are kind of like a little stealth nod to it. Like, the first time you see her, she's getting out of a little um, Cairo tube thing, kind of like she gets into at the end of Aliens. Oh, I see. Um, the mechs that everyone's seen in the commercials, you know, they kind of look like a beefed-up version of the Cairo, of the um, power loader from Aliens, etc., etc. Oh, okay. So, you know, stuff like that. Okay, so how long is the movie? Um, I don't remember. I think it was like about two and a half hours, give or take. Is that kind of long for a 3D movie? I never saw one that long. Um... Not too bad. You know, you don't notice. It doesn't drag like some movies do, where you kind of like, get on with it. Okay, but, so you know. how was the action? Was it too much action, or no, was it... No, it was good. Okay, was well, so it's like a nice uh, it balance a between flow. plot and action? Yeah. You know, good okay. flow with that, the, you know, some of the comics release scenes when he's, you know, going through the, where the main character's going through the, you know, um, Dances with Wolves, getting one, one with the tribe scene, you know, falling off the horse and whatnot. Okay. Yeah, so it had some comedy and not overbearing. Okay. And how, uh, if you could rate it, what grade would it be? Oh, eight and a half out of ten, I guess. Eight and a half. Wow. That's a B plus. Or actually, just a B. Solid, yeah. nice, solid B. Yeah. Just a few too many anvils there. Okay. Uh, here's the last question. It's important. Do you like giving foot massages? No. Oh, you don't. Are you sure? Yes. I've had enough of this.